the National Association of Nigerian Students, NANS, has vowed to continue its protests until the federal government grants ASU's requests and returns them to classrooms. Plus TV, Africa, Plus TV News correspondent Lavi Koko Yedoko reports that the students blocked the airport's roads, preventing traffic flow both inward and outward the area. This is an airport road in Lagos, a major access road to the Marcella Mohammed International Airport, Ikeja. It was a standstill traffic situation as motorists were prevented from going inward and outward while the nuns' protest lasted. The road is being taken over by students protesting against the ongoing strike by members of the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU. Not even persuasions, entreaties from the Nigerian police nor the morning downpour could deter these students from going ahead with their protest. They are demanding an immediate end to the ASU strike, which has entered its seventh month. Akin Teye Babatunde is NAN's national vice president, external affairs, and has expressed sadness over how the ASU strike has lingered. The struggle we've started, we want this strike to be called off. It is embarrassing. It is disgracing. We need this to be, we need this strike to be called off. What is the problem? What does it cause them to end a, a seven-month-old strike? If the if the minister of education, or it is even glaring that they are they are they are failures, since they failed, change them or take the negotiation away from the ends, and let other people take a, take over the negotiation so that we can we can resume back to school. And we want the federal government to know we are serious about this agitation. We want them to know we mean business, and we want them to end this strike now. So those are the reasons why we choose this point. We know staying in this place, we, we create a lot of inconvenience for this, to the masses, even to the government. It will cause embarrassment for them, and especially a question on their integrity as a government. And that is why we've chosen this place to start our agitation today. Motorists and those having flights to catch up with felt the brunt of the action as they have to go by foot, carrying their luggage on their heads. I've been here since 8, after eight, like 20 minutes after 8, I've been here. Well, the demonstration here with the protests is, is what it's about. I think they should do more going to Abuja, National Assembly, blocking National Assembly and the airport too. Even especially that uh, it affects me, but I think it's, it's worth it because uh, we don't have uh, listening leaders in this country, understand? And uh, the worst part of it is that they don't listen. Even if this uh, protest should continue for, they don't care because they don't have their kids here in Nigeria University. So they don't care the state of the university and all that. Over eight to nine months, how do you want such kind of a student after graduating to be a good leader or to be valuable to the society? So we want government, especially President Momodou Buhari, to come to our aid in this country. Enough is enough for this strike. We want the student to go back to the class. We want the lecturer to go back to the class so that Nigeria can be proud of better generation. Meanwhile, the student body says they are going nowhere and has vowed to continue the protest. It, however, remains to be seen if this action by Nance would make any difference. Love Ikuku Uyedoku, Plus TV News. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.